In this video we're going to show you how to use Upwire's Voice IT module for enrolling and verifying users via an automated Voice IVR workflow. The first step is to click on the green Start a New Workflow icon and give your workflow a name. We then need to select an inbound project and select a voice template. And this takes us to our Sandpit environment where we can click on the blue phone icon and click Open Builder to build out our content. This brings you into our drag and drop canvas environment where you have all the available voice modules on the left hand side. We are going to start here by dragging on a menu module. Click on the settings cog to open the text to speech editor and type in your desired message. Here we will say please press 1 to enroll, please press 2 to verify. You will then just need to click on the branching icon and add your branching, 1 for enroll, 2 for verify. You then need to drag on your Voice IT module and connect it up via the nodes. Under the basic information icon we just need to set the module to enrollment and then set what we're asking the customer for, in this case we're going to say customer account number and then set our internal bindings for our customer ID and our Voice IT ID. Next we just need to click on the Voice IT options icon and put in our Voice IT credentials. If you don't have any you can sign up using the link above. Here we also enter the saying we require for the voice print. For example, never forget tomorrow is a new day. The next two settings are get customer endpoint and create customer endpoint. These are used to query your customer database to determine whether the current user exists in your system. If the user does not exist, it will enroll the user once the required number of voice prints has been captured. Just set the endpoint and required bindings for your web service to return the required information. The final option is to set some custom error handlers if required. And that completes the setup for the Voice IT module. Now we can add on whatever modules you would like to come next. Here we will just add a simple information module for success and one for failure. Again, add your required message, one for success and one for failure. Finally, we just need to drag on a hang up module to end the call. Next, to add the verify side of the flow, you can simply copy the enrollment module and drag it across. Click on the basic info icon and change the setting to verification, and it's as simple as that, all of the remaining settings are already populated. And again, it's just a matter of dragging on your next module for a successful verification and typing in your desired message. And this is the step where you would place the caller into the secure area of your call. And then you just drag on one more module for a failed verification and again type your desired message. From there you can simply connect the module to the hangup module you've already added to end the flow. For the final step in the canvas we're just going to head back up to the green settings module and assign a caller ID for this flow. And at the top here we can do a quick check for errors before heading back to the sandpit and hitting the rocket icon which will launch our flow. And that's it. In just a few minutes we've been able to set up a flow to enroll and verify callers based on their voice print using the new Voice IT Voice Biometrics module on the Upwire platform. If you have any questions, please reach out to us at sales at upwire.com.